What does trauma zine represent for you? Well, to me, trauma zine basically means like facing yourself. Mm. Like what you go through when you finally decide to... Mm accept what you've been through and come out on the other end as the person that you see yourself becoming or that you want to be. Mm -hmm. So I feel like I had to make up a new word for this new experience that I'm going through. Yo, when I looked at your page and I saw the definition, I had to go into like Webster to see if it was No, they're going to put it in there now. <laughs> <laughs> I believe that they're, they're going to have to put that in there. <laughs> they're going to put that in there for yeah. sure. What do you feel like that reflection period was like for you and, and really translating that into to I'm the music? I'm definitely still going through it. Mm. I feel like everybody that has been through something, like they can kind of see it on other people that have been through something. And I feel like we kind of got this like language where, okay, I understand you might be having a bad day it might not have nothing to do with me so let me treat you with a little bit more courtesy you know mm. what i'm saying like i feel like i could tell when somebody is like a tough person and you know probably why they might be a little tough i don't know everybody's story but like right. i just want to i just feel like i want to treat people how i would want everybody to treat me you know what okay. i'm saying but anyways my reflection journey i feel like it's still happening but i know that i'm i've been through these things and i know i'm not perfect and i know i know it's gonna get better but i'm accepting the fact that i have to go on this journey to get there Mm -hmm. And some of the things that you, some of the things are uncomfortable to say out loud. Like right. you have to say them to yourself. But it, you know, I'm going through that awkward little uncomfortable phase. That's but, okay though. Yeah. That, in that phase, you you find out a lot about yourself. But this is like, I, I feel like this has been a process for you because when we yeah. were, when we were talking and, and before, I think that was 2020, mm -hmm. and you were telling me about you know taking some time for yourself and reflecting and watching movies by yourself, taking yeah. yourself on dates. Like you've been on this journey. You know? I've been on this journey, but I feel like it's probably a little bit more intense than it mm. was. Like I feel like when something happens to me, I kind of like push it to the side. Like and okay. I I kind of work through everything. Like if something's bothering me, I don't like sit down and talk about it or I'm not like expressing myself I'm just like okay well throw a bunch of stuff on my calendar so I can like not even right, think about busy. it right, yeah right. but now I'm like okay girl let's talk about it because I'm sick of talking to people and exploding with the 30 <laughs> minutes in the couch I'm just like you know what 